All right, coming up next, it's a lightweight championship fight between Khabib Nurmagomedov and Justin Gaethje. As hard a title shot to come by as there is in any UFC division is at 155 pounds. Here he is, the consensus number one lightweight title challenger, the number one contender, at least in terms of the rankings, getting set for a title fight here tonight. A lot of people think he is a live underdog in this championship setting. I guess we'll find out here, Joe Rogan. As he steps towards this cage, he understands this is one of the biggest moments in his life, the biggest moment in his career. He is looking to take this title, and he believes his time is now. His preparation has gone perfectly. He is in outstanding shape. He has a great game plan and a great camp, and he believes that he will emerge the new champion of the world tonight after this fight. All right, here's the UFC lightweight champion of the world defending his belt yet again. This has been one dominant 155-pound fighter, ladies and gentlemen. You know this is a belt that frequently changes hands. Well, it hasn't since it's been wrapped around this guy's waist, given all the skills he brings to the table. The question is, fighting a challenger like this, can he hold on to the belt? If he can, just another chapter in the greatness of one of the best lightweights this octagon has ever seen. The champion headed to the cage right now is in the groove. He is in his prime right now. His training for this bout has been perfect. He believes he has a solid game plan and he's ready to step in here and retain his title. He is well prepared for this contest. Kill the tape for this lightweight scrap. Both fighters 29 years of age. And they both possess a similar height and reach. All right, now with the official introductions, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, her game. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas, it's time! Five rounds for the UFC Lightweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer. Holding a professional record of 19 wins, two losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Presenting the challenger, Justin the Highlight Gage. And now he's the champion, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a grappler, holding a professional record of. 27 wins, no losses. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of the Republic of Afghanistan, Russia, ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending UFC lightweight champion of the world, Habib and Igor. This is for the championship. You've been given your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. They touch him up, and we are underway. Ready to fight? Ready. Scheduled for five rounds if need be. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. Oh, powerful right leg kick. Oh, strong punch there by Nermago Metal. Oh, good head movement there. Nice slip. Nermago Metal gets the early takedown. Nice hammer fist. Big shot. He's posturing up here. 
Oh, beautiful, beautiful right hand by the champion. Very nice sweep. Excellent sweep winds up in guard. Oh, nice punch there by Gaethje. Gaethje gets up. He is back on the feet here. Oh, he lands another hook there. It's been a big weapon for him here tonight, and he's gotten increasingly more efficient with it as this fight has gone up. Under three minutes remain in round one. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Oh, nice kick there. Oh! This could be it right here. Back and forth we go. Be out. Wow, what a kick. Huge kick lands. Oh. He hurt him with that hook. There's a single attempt. Now goes in and secures the takedown. He's in half guard here. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. He moves to the Mount of Crucifix. This is ugly. Back to side control. Now the hammer fist here by Nermago Metal. And Dizzy as he looks to improve position here. Closing the distance here. Nermago Metal gets double underhooks here in the clinch. Normally now he'll try to change levels and go for a takedown. Lands an outside leg kick of his own. Wow, what a back and forth exchange. Oh, he tags him with the straight hand there. Nice job by Gaethje. Gaethje gets the take down there. Oh, look at that! Look at that transition! Nice punch there by Nurmago Medov. He's got his back. Huge oh. set for the end of round one. So he heads back to the stool after a dominant round. Great round there from Nurmago Medov. There was a huge moment in that round and a huge moment in this fight. Strikes, strikes, strikes. Let's take a look at that again. And let's look at that again from another angle. The beautiful Jenny Andrade. Getting us going. Second round underway. This is gonna become one of those things where you're just wondering what's, what's the opponent gonna be able to do to him. Not even whether or not he's gonna win, but what's his opponent gonna be able to do to him. Agomedov gets absolutely punished by that head kick. Splits the guard and connects with the punch. How about that shin? Well, he left his head open there, Joe, and he got cracked with that jab. He was almost moving into it, so let's see if he can switch up the footwork here, Joe, and make the requisite adjustments. Agomedov gets tagged with that jab. Pretty good weapon for him tonight. He's keeping busy. Oh, this could be it. The champ is rocked. He's in deep trouble right now. Deep trouble. He's trying to hang on. Both guys landing big shots. Body kick, look at that. Beautiful timing with the left hand. Hard straight punch. Reversal here, nicely done. Nurmago met up and try to further expose what surface tonight as an obvious weakness. Moves into north-south. Working for the choke here, trying to get that arm underneath the back of the neck. Now from here, he wants to get that left hand into play 
clasp his hands together, drop his weight down, and apply pressure with the choke. Oh, and this fight's is. over. This fight's over. He got the choke for the tap. So yeah, it came down to tap out or go to sleep, and his opponent chose the former. The choke was clearly sunk in deep, perfect technique, and ultimately that is one of the bigger wins of his career. He gets it done by submission here tonight. And here's the end. And here it is again, absolutely perfectly executed. And one more time, nice technique here on this submission. So there is the man they are all chasing at 155 pounds, the undisputed UFC lightweight champion. And how about the way he got it done tonight? A spectacular submission to finish the job. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Gaines brought a stop to this contest. At two minutes, 59 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by tap out. And still. Many argue it's the UFC's toughest weight class. It's one of the more difficult belts to defend, but he certainly did just that here tonight. Congratulations to the undisputed UFC lightweight champion, your winner by submission. And now all that's left to do is to celebrate with the corner. Big finish and a big result here tonight.